Hi guys, how you doing? I'm doing honey pop right now. Alright. I don't know how long this is gonna record for. Hi there. Wait, what yeah, you? Me? <laughs> Sorry, I just don't talk to me. <laughs> I think I'm in love with you. Okay, maybe we can take a Nice to meet you. Hi, Q. You. you mean like the nope, letter? Not like that at all. Look, dude. Are you gonna be all right? Looks like you're having some trouble holding it together over there. I think you're having some trouble holding it together over there. <sighs> no, I'm chill. I'm chill. What do you mean? I'm fine. What do I mean? I mean, I can literally see you sweating through your shirt. Is it that obvious? Is it that obvious? <laughs> Watch that. Oh God, You're so you pretty and that? stuff. Is this happening? Hmm, wait. You know what? This might actually work. What yeah. might actually work? Yeah! Oh man, this is your lucky day, buddy! It Listen, is? I gotta go, but we'll meet again real soon. Trust me. Night! Ah. <sighs> hey you, rise and shine, we've got work to do! I said get Oh, it's still recording. Mmm, <sighs> five more minutes. Oh, I was having the best. I bet you were. Afraid not. This is totally happening. Don't you recognize this adorable face? <laughs> it's Kiyu from the bar. <laughs> I'm so Why confused. Are they always Right now, what's if you going can't tell on? By now, I'm a fairy. Well, a love fairy to be exact. <laughs> oh, well, why didn't you just say so? <laughs> <laughs> Funny. But let's leave the sarcasm to me, alright? You see, as a love fairy, it's my job to help poor saps like you out with the ladies. It's just mm, what I do. I don't like to brag, but I'll have you know I have a very impressive track record. All of my previous clients are basically walking babe magnets now. You though. <clears throat> Let's just say you will be my greatest accomplishment yet. What do you want? I mean, why do you want to help me? What's in it for you? Man, you and all the questions. Can't a fairy just help a brother out? We need to get started right away. Tell me, how many dates have you been on? <laughs> oh my <laughs> god, it's worse than I thought, isn't it? Alright, grab your shit. We're going on a date right now. But if I don't Someone want has to, to show you the ropes. Can I just stay I know home? a place nearby that's open pretty late. You'll love it. Or not, I don't care. I'll try to make this quick. This is the date grid. These little pieces are called tokens. You earn affection by matching three or more of the circular tokens horizontally or vertically. For a successful date, 
You have to fill the affection meter before you run out of moves. Go ahead, give it a shot. Match those orange ones with the crescent shape in the middle of the grid. Okay, there you go. See? Easy! Each of the four types of affection tokens represents a particular trait. The orange ones represent romance, blue is talent, green is flirtation, and red is sexuality. Pay attention to which trait your date prefers. It'll go a long way. Of course, matching four or five tokens will get you even more affection. I'll show you. Match those four sexuality tokens in the bottom right of the grid, the red ones. Okay, there you go. Sweet. Okay, what's next? Oh, All right. what's next? Let me cover the other token types real quick. The pink hearts are passion tokens. Matching those will raise your date's passion level. The higher her passion level is, the more affection you'll earn. The gold bells are joy tokens. You'll get an extra move by matching those. Very useful. The broken heart tokens are bad news. Seriously, avoid matching those as best you can. Finally, the teardrops are sentiment tokens. Matching those gives you, well, sentiment. You need sentiment in order to use date gifts. And seeing as how you don't have any date gifts, I'm guessing I need to explain that too. Here, I'll hook you up with one of mine. It's on the house. Like I said, you'll need sentiment to use it. So go ahead and match those three sentiment tokens in the leftmost column, the teardrops. Oh, he's... Okay, now go ahead and give that date gift to me. Cool, huh? There are like a ton of different date gifts that you can get too. They each have a unique effect on the date and can be extremely useful in combination. Oh, <laughs> and thanks to a little fairy magic, you'll never actually lose them. So you can use them on your next date too. <laughs> Is that cool or what? All right, all right, I've gone on long enough. I'll let you finish up the date so you can get the hang of it. Oh, and don't worry, I won't let you fail this one. I'm not that mean. I'm sure you're not. <laughs> yeah. I have it in me to punch you right in the nose. Oh shit, it's morning already? We are way behind schedule. Okay, check it out. I have one last thing to give you, and this is important. Introducing the latest in Love Fairy technology, the Honey Bee 4.0. The Honey Bee is an essential lifeline for any player on the go. It automatically registers the info of new girls you meet and can even track their location. You can organize your inventory, buy new gifts, upgrade your traits. It's awesome! We don't have time to go over every feature, but you're a big boy. You can figure it out. To access the honeybee, all you have to do is right-click at pretty much any time. 
Or if you're... Reopening, dude. What is your problem? What is your problem? What is your problem, man? Why am I speaking okay. a Jamaican? But yeah, let's That's do this shit. Like. Now, if you, I've done. We can. Ricky, couldn't have picked it better myself. All right, ready? Get your game face on. <sighs> Good morning, Aiko. Oh, hey, Belly. What's wrong? Seems like something's bothering you. Yeah, life. <laughs> How are classes going? Uh, I don't want to talk about that. Mm, well, I Why? think I have just the thing. I'm headed to the beach to work in a few poses. You should join me. Nothing like a little exercise to melt that stress away. Uh, not today. I'm just not feeling it. Will I at least be seeing you this weekend at the studio? I'll be there. I don't think I have anything else going on for once. Great. Can't wait. See you there. Dude. Bro, Asian chicks don't even get me started. I have like the worst case of yellow fever ever, ever. Like a yellow plague. Oh yeah, yeah don't well, good for you. They can't see or hear me. I'm just a figment of your imagination. Plot twist. <laughs> nah, I'm crazy real. I just hid myself from everyone so I can give you advice on the sidelines. This is a tough approach. She's kind of in a shitty mood, so say something stupid to try and cheer her up. It doesn't matter Let's what. Be around the someone stupider who's the better. Stupider the better. How, oh, that one's funny. Isn't it funny how life is pointless and nothing matters? <laughs> I ask myself the same thing all the time. Mission accomplished. Good work. I'm just trying to relax. Yeah, mission accomplished. Time in Good work. Classes. I teach up at UOG. You know the place? It's like the only university in the city for some reason. I don't know about that. I have a couple students who might agree with you, though. <laughs> I'm glad you came over here. I needed a good laugh. The kids call me Miss Yumi, but you can call me Aiko. Okay, Miss no. Aiko. Wait! You did it! Well, with my help, of course. I gotta admit, I did not expect you to pull that off. Beginner's luck. Don't let it go to your head. By the way, that other chick that was here just a second ago? Since she was in range, the honeybee started tracking her location too. So after you're done here with this girl, you can go catch up with her, too. Just bust out the honeybee and check out the girl finder screen. I'm pumped. You pumped? Yeah, you're pumped. Go get him. I'll be around if you need me. <laughs> what am I saying? Of course you need me. Let's change difficulty to easy because I can't do normal. Or... Um... You, Go sir, on. have got yourself a date.
The least desired trait is talent, so I don't know why. Again sometime. Mm -hmm. I'm sure you'll forget anyway, but it's November 9th. with you. I'm 28. Something I can help you with? Of course, every woman's favorite question. I'm 109, you dick. options on campus are so gross. Let me ask you something. You a political... Yeah, I had... I've got a question for you. Oh, shit. That would be pretty hot. No, well, I think that's gonna end it here.
Well, that was honey pop for you.